pronto. It is time to make an Italian pasta dish from scratch with a man who knows the importance of homemade pasta. When I grew up, when I was kids, in the house smelling of the sauce, of the ragu, of the salsiccia, and that's the difference. That's why we, when you do pasta, you have to make it with love. To learn how, we turn to owner of Pomo Pizzeria, Stefano Fabri, who taught us how to make... Strozza preti alla salsiccia. Strozza preti o strozzita. Did I just swear in Italian? Kind of. AKA pasta and sausage. First up, put the work in and make the dough. This is the super simple, no egg in this pasta. Yep, it's only three ingredients, flour, salt, and water. Add a little bit of water at the beginning, then you add more water. Once you get a dough-like consistency, need for about 10 minutes. And you always use your hands? Yes, always. And then you let the dough rest for another 30 minimum. Once your dough is rested, take a small section and get to rolling. Turn it. Turn it, roll it, turn roll it, roll it. Yes, the strozza pretty has to be a really thin. Not as easy as it looks, but doable. So it's this, perfect. right? And then you flip it. Yes. You're doing amazing. It's perfect. And now we show how to cut the pasta. Using a pizza cutter, cut the edges off, carefully cut squares into the dough, and roll each one in your hand. Ah! Can I try one? Perfect. Perfect. Not as good as yours. Not as good as yours. Your pasta will only take around 12 minutes to cook. Now, it's time for the secret sauce. Tell me about your sauce. Okay, the sauce is made with onion. We saute the onion for a little bit, and then we put the sausage. And after, we put a little bit of red wine, Ooh. and then a little bit of uh, tomato paste. Cook the sauce for about two hours, add to your pasta with a touch of cream, and voila. Oh my gosh. That is just like my mama used to never make. Because she never made pasta, but I wish she had. Bravo, Stefano. Grazie for teaching us how to cook yummy homemade pasta with love.